Okay, and this we're going to talk about the Roku Stick Plus. Um, with this Roku Stick Plus, I am actually able to get thousands of free stations. You can get thousands of movie stations, thousands of kids stations, thousands of documentaries, thousands of sports stations. Uh, you name it, you can you can get it. It also gives you the option to get the paid stations if you want to get Netflix, if you want to get HBO. Uh, if all the paid stations, it gives you that option if you want to go that route. I am all about free movies. Uh, I don't want to pay for TV. Um, I actually made another video. I don't know if you guys have seen my last video. Um, it was kind of controversial with some people. Uh, I don't know why. Uh, what I did was I took an outdoor TV antenna and I screwed it onto the outdoor direct TV satellite dish to see what would happen. And I ended up getting tons of free local stations. Uh, I was really shocked because I didn't know I had that many local stations. I think I got like 87 free local stations. I was expecting maybe 10. Um, so yeah, but that video was all about how to um, get free local stations. Uh, this video is going to be about how to get free movie stations. And so I started looking around. I didn't want to pay for, uh, I got rid of cable, so I didn't want another monthly bill. Um, I really liked not having to pay for TV. So I did some research and I found the Roku Stick Plus. And it's awesome. It's it's unlimited the amount of movies and TV that you can find on this thing. Um, it's it's about apps. I don't know if you guys are familiar with the iPhone. Uh, it's the iPhone is all about apps, and um, inside each app is um, you know its own little world. It's kind of the same thing with the Roku Stick Plus. Uh, th there's hundreds of apps on there, and each app will have uh, tons of movies and um, stations that you can watch. So you just you basically have to pick which apps you like. Um, so then there are the paid apps as well. Like I said, if you want to go with Netflix and all this other HBO, it does give you that option. Uh, not me. I'm about free. Uh, but again, you can watch all the free stuff too. So um, yeah, it's it's kind of cool. You just pick which apps you, what apps you want. You click on that app, and then it'll, it'll get just this whole world of um, TV, movie stations, and and comedies and sports and it's just unlimited so today what i'm going to do is i'm going to show you how to hook up this roku stick plus to your tv i'm going to show you how to get it going and i'm going to show you all the stuff that it does and show you how you can get free movie stations also all right let's do this okay guys this is the roku streaming stick plus um like i said this will give you thousands of free movie stations every pretty pretty much every station you can think of and again, as it, show, as it shows you, you can also get paid if you wanted to get HBO, Showtime, uh, all these others. It gives you the option to get these all these paid ones as well. Um, but we're all about free. So anyways, this is the actual Roku stick here. This will actually go on the back of your TV, and it plugs into your HDMI import or port. And... Um, this is the power cord, which will plug into this, like so. And then this will plug into the uh, outlet from the wall for the power cord. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to plug this into the back of the TV, and uh, we'll get it going. Okay, guys, so we have it plugged in here. Uh, this cord is actually the power cord plugged into the wall. And I have it plugged into the Roku stick here. Now we're going to take this Roku stick and we're going to plug it into the port behind the TV. So we're going to take the Roku stick and we're going to plug it right here. Voila. Plugged in. Okay, guys. Uh, as you can see, as soon as we plug the Roku stick into the back of the TV, it is telling us right away what to do on the screen and how to uh, get the Roku stick connected. Uh, it is telling us first thing that we have to do is pair the remote to the TV. So to pair the remote, what you do is you flip it over and you take off the battery cover and you will see this button right here. You push this button and it will pair the remote to the TV. Okay, so now we have the remote paired with the TV. So now we can use the remote to finish the setup. Uh, it is, you can use the up and down buttons to scroll to which language you want. I'm going to go to English. So to, 
So I'm going to push enter. Now it's asking me which Wi-Fi I want to hook up to. So I'm going to pick, uh, push again, push OK for enter. And you type in the code. Obviously, I'm going to blur this out so you guys cannot see this. Okay, we are now connected to the Wi-Fi. Okay, now it's saying press OK and the Roku will analyze your HDMI connection during this process. Your TV screen may go blank for several minutes. So we will push this OK button right here. And basically what it's going to do is going to analyze our TV to see what kind of connection we can get. My TV is an older TV, so I cannot get the 4K because I don't have it on this TV. This TV is probably 11 years old, if not older. So uh, this, the most, it's saying the most I can get is 1080p. So, uh, which is fine. So we'll go OK. 1080p. And we'll push yes, screen looks good. TV power and volume can be controlled with your Roku stick. So it's, it's telling you right here uh, how to work the, uh, the remote control. Uh, the side button um, controls the volume up and down. And of course the power is the very top button on the top. So it's asking me, is, is music playing? So we'll hit yes. Has the music stopped? Yes, it has stopped. Success. Roku remote is set up and control this TV power and volume. All right. It's telling me to enter the email address to get Roku activation link. Uh, so you have to, um, so it's basically going to send me a, a link through my email and I will connect through that link to get the Roku stick connected. So um, let me type in my email address so it can send me that link to my email. Okay, we have the, it's now telling me that it's sending the link to my email. So now I have to go to my email to get this link. All right, we are here in my email and uh, this is the email they sent me. Uh, it's telling me to click on this for the link to uh, get it connected. So the name of the device is Roku Streaming, Streaming Stick Plus. We're going to pick which room we have it in. Uh, let's call it um, Family Room. I have red and agree. Sure. Okay. Uh, it's asking me... Okay, now this is actually payment um, if you choose to go with the paid option. This is not necessary. You do not have to pay for anything on this thing. This is only if you decide you want to go with a Netflix or you want to go with one of the other paid um, programs that are on this. It does give you the option, as I told you before, if you want the paid options to for Netflix and HBO and Showtime and all that stuff, it, it, um, you can get that through this streaming stick. But we're going to bypass this because, again, we don't want to pay for TV. So let's just skip this step. Okay, now let's get you set up to stream. Do you pay for cable or satellite TV? Not anymore. Do you currently subscribe to any of these services? I actually am a Prime member here. And I have, I don't subscribe, but I have Pandora. Uh, that's it. I might have this. I don't know. I have Apple. Okay, now it's it's asking you what you like to watch so it can actually build um, your programming for you. So, of course, we like free TV movies. Let me zoom in on this so you guys can see a little bit better. I don't want to get too blurry for you guys. Okay, um, music, sure. Education, eh, okay. Comedy, of course, got to have comedy. Premium services, I'm not looking for premium services. Um, sports, sure. 
reality pop culture, not really my thing, but who knows, maybe. Rent by movies, maybe someday. Kids and family, sure. Local news, of course. Crime and mystery, love it. Food and home, okay. News and weather, sure. No, I don't speak Spanish. No premium services. You know what? I'll click it in case somebody wants to get it later. And continue. Okay. Add more Chinese Roku stick. They're free to install. So, HBO. I don't want HBO. It's asking you all these. If you want to add any other stuff. Uh, no thanks. Startup to free trials. Okay, this is giving you free trials. Again, this is for all the paid stuff. If you're interested in the paid stuff, you have free trials where you can try it. If you're not interested, you can cancel any time. So you get this app on your phone and then you can use your phone as the remote control for the Roku. I don't need that. I already have a remote. Tips and tricks. We don't need that. But we're done. Setup is complete. All right, so now we go back to the TV. All right, guys, we are back to the TV. And right now it is doing a channel update, which is basically means it's adding the channels uh, based on what you chose in the link, um, what you like to watch as far as stations and movies. And so it's just adding all those options in for you uh, right now. So we're just waiting for it to finish uh, this update, and then we will continue with the setup. Okay, it looks like uh, we're all done. It just added in all these stations uh, based on what we chose on the link. And so let's see what we have. Let's push the arrow here. Let's see you streaming. Do hey, it's talking. If you're a new Roku player, we'll start with your remote. Press home at any time to return to the home screen. Back, always returns to the previous screen. And star shows additional options. Press this button while streaming to see the options menu. Press and hold the mic button on Home Remote or the free Roku mobile app to search for entertainment, control your streaming, and more. Now let's check out your home menu. Visit the streaming channel to find your favorites and discover new ones. Search to see where to stream things for free or at the lowest cost. Feature free for quick access to free TV. And be sure to check out the Roku channel for more free, live, and premium entertainment. For more information and other cool features, visit the Tips and Tricks channel on your home screen. And that's it. Happy streaming. Okay, that's basically just a run through of how to use your remote control. Um, now, here we are. This is it. This is the home screen. Uh, you can scroll down here. Um, but like I told you before, these are all apps. Just like if you have a, a Apple phone, everything is all apps. And in, inside each one of these apps, you have hundreds of movies, if not thousands of movies or stations, channels, whatever you want to call them. Okay, so here's Netflix, which is obviously paid. So um, Prime Video, I'm a Prime member. So let's click on here. Okay, so now we are signed in to Amazon and check it out. This is crazy, guys. You can scroll down and see all of these movies. It just goes on. It's just endless. These are popular movies. And you can just scroll through here and watch any of these movies for free. These are Amazon originals. These are movies made with, through Amazon. They've got some good ones in here sometimes. So they have series and movies and and different things that you can watch. Uh, mysteries. AAPI movies. I don't know what that is. but These are blockbuster movies. Check this out. Tons of movies. And this is just on this one app. Uh, science fiction, science fiction, categories, mental health awareness, kids and family, black movies, Asian, Pacific American Heritage Month. Okay. Uh, Prime Video Channels. These are paid. Um, included with Prime. All these movies. Yeah, it's just endless, guys. Mind you, this is just this one app. So, we're going to go back to the home screen. 
And again, each one of these apps will have hundreds of stations or channels for you to choose from. Okay, so let's try Pluto. Add another example. Okay, let it kick in here. Okay. This is a uh, This is basically just all the channels, all the stations on this one app. Romance, crime, thrillers, horror. This is more of a, a TV. I think we have some, some movie stations on here as well. But this is like uh, got some just different stuff on here. Adventure, commercial action, comedy, drama, action, romance, crime movies, thrillers, horror, what do you call me? Terror. Okay. So that's, again, just on that one app. Let's go back to the home screen. Each one, okay, now let's, let's scroll down here. You can do a search. Basically, you can search for different movies, whatever you want to watch. You would just type it in here, and it will show you uh, where to find it. Uh, streaming channels, settings, home. So, yeah, it's the movies are endless on this thing, you guys, and they're free. If you want the paid, you can get it, but who wants to pay for TV when you can have free? Uh, again, you can, each one of these apps, look, here's Pandora for music, if you want some music. Here is ESPN Sports. Uh, YouTube, you can watch YouTube videos on here. Uh, this, you can watch street cams. You can actually watch street cams. Uh, what else do we have on here? Comedy Central, America's Funniest Animals, UFC, of course, love UFC. Uh, discovery it's just endless guys it's just endless and you could add more apps as well if you want to add more apps than what's on here now it does give you the option to add more apps okay guys in today's video I showed you how to get thousands of free channels stations whether it be movie stations TV stations sports stations comedy stations it's just endless. Uh, and again, it's with this Roku Stick Plus. This thing is awesome. You'll love it. Um, I will leave a link below um, if you want to go ahead and buy one for yourself. Okay, guys, if you learned anything today, please like and subscribe. It really helps out my channel and it helps me to bring you more videos in the future. All right, thanks.